I would walk into my daughter's school every day and I would wear a different wig almost every day. I'd be a redhead one day, a blonde, and, and it was like three or four weeks in and one of the teachers went, are you doing something different with your hair? And I thought, oh my gosh, how do they not know this? I wanted to feel what our clients felt. I wanted to understand what it was like to live your life every day with a wig. And I was gonna do it for a week, maybe two, and it wound up lasting 88 days. I was now that client that didn't know exactly how to shop for what I wanted. And I had to go on my own website and try to figure out my face shape and what worked best for me. And I had to figure out on my own the questions that I knew the answers to, but didn't experience, I wanted to actually experience. You feel a little self-conscious, like maybe somebody's gonna be able to tell that you have a wig on or it's gonna look fake. I really don't know why I was nervous because I knew I had a great wig on, but you just feel nervous because I guess it's because you know you don't look like you normally look and so you feel a little self-conscious. But people don't really notice like you think that they do. I had people that have known me and are with me every day that said, did you do a little something to your hair and the color was completely different. We just think, oh my gosh, they're, they're seeing this or they're noticing that. People are so not doing that because they're worried about, they're, they're worried about themselves. Yes, it's true. Then I felt a little more comfortable to try different things and I did feel free, yes. I got flirted with a little more as a blonde. <laughs> I wore them because I want to, and it was exciting and fun for me. I'm well aware that many of our clients come to us not wanting to. I want them to experience the joy. Try not to think about how you don't look like you always looked. Try to embrace and be happy about how you do look amazing, how you've got perfect, beautiful hair. It really changes your heart and your mind about what you're doing. And I didn't mean to go 88 days, I just, one day led to the other, led to the other, and I fell in love. I fell in love with wigs. Now I have a different outfit and I always think, oh, that color would look good with that, or this collar would look good with a shorter wig, or, and so I'm factoring in, they've become an accessory for me. We're not actually curing the cancer, we're not making big monumental world changes, but to me, if you can give somebody confidence in their heart and feel good, that's, that's monumental for us.